This is the Kohler 1078578 flush valve assembly kit. Now what this kit's going to include is of course the complete flush valve with the flapper and the short chain here. And then the rubber gasket here at the opening. Now it'll also come with the S hook and a separate bag here. Now this is the hook that's going to attach to this chain, which will attach the chain to the lever. And then it'll include a little list of instructions here. Let's go ahead and get that opened up. It has labeled replace the flush valve. It'll walk you through each step there. It's also listed in a few different languages as well. And then I believe this is the instruction kit for that S hook, or just like a little picture guide for it. Yeah, so just another short little list of installation instructions. And then we'll go ahead and get a couple dimensions of the parts included. Starting with the flush valve itself, we're going to measure the opening here at that gasket. So the inner diameter, we're looking at right at about two, about two and a quarter inches, just below, say just below two and a half. And we can also measure the opening for the flapper, which is going to be kind of hard to see, but I'll try my best to make it visible on the camera. Let's see if I can even get it lined up here. There we go. So that's right about the same as that opening. So just below two and a half inches. And we'll also get a total height. And for total height, I'm going to measure from here all the way to the top of this pipe or tube here. Let's just line it up on the side. It's going to be a little hard. I think we can make it work. This is just kind of rough approximate measurement. It's going to be right at about seven and a quarter inches for that total height. And once again, this is the Kohler 107-8578 flush valve assembly kit.